Good morning, everybody. Hello, Connie. Hello, Teresa. Hello to everybody. Anyway, um, today I'm going to be cleaning, doing some projects, and starting in the... Look, I got this. It's brand new. Ikea. Love, 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 love. Gonna paint the pot. Tawny black. <laughs> love. Anyway, I think it's gonna stay here on the coffee table, too. I actually bought it for the bathroom, thinking it might replace the branches, but it didn't work in there. But I think it looks fabulous right here. Love, love, love. Casual, farmhouse, and elegant. That's the way the, uh, the direction of my place is going. Kind of an elegant farmhouse. Uh, that sounds um, a little like I'm tooting my own horn, but that's, that's how it's feeling to me anyway. What do you guys think? Good morning, Mr. Bean. Okay, so today is cleaning day, project day. Already started the dishes, I'm watching the news. I'm gonna do some laundry, <sighs> wash the floors, all that stuff, clean the bathroom. Have to do the bedding, take care of the scatter rugs, take care of the cat. Good morning, nun. And all that while, at the same time, working in here. So I'm going to start in here. So obviously I've got to start by, you know, going through all this stuff, um, kind of sorting as I go. Oh, Brenda, if you're watching, Brenda's a friend of mine. I used to work with her here in Kelowna. I have started a basket for her. Um, she was uh, kind enough to come over and buy some stuff from me when I was doing a lot of editing and whatnot when I first moved in. So now I am just going to give her a surprise basket full of stuff um, when I'm done, you know, sorting through everything. And hopefully she likes it because she's so nice. Anyway, look at this. This is kind of fun. This is a project. I got this. It was a couple bucks. And I, th I think it's supposed to be a little tray for jewelry. You know, you hang stuff from it and then you put stuff here. That's so not what I'm doing with it. So it's going to get a little paint job and it will probably, uh, I don't know, it looks so Christmassy to me, so I think it'll probably be a Christmas thing. But anyway, that's another tiny little project. Lots of tiny little projects that I will have to, you know, give their own home. Because I, I, this is the project room. All right, anyway, I'm going to get started and I will talk to you guys later. Bye! Good morning, everybody. So here we are in, I guess this is, would be phase one of the transformation of my project room. So here we are. Here, this used to be a closet. And it's just had these really, really makeshift uh, shelves installed. See, everything is pretty much raw. These are melamine top. And I think they'll look nice against the black, so I'll probably end up leaving these and I'll paint the edges and then they'll probably get those labels that I have a zillion of. And yeah, so it's pretty dark down there, but you can kind of see it's really, really makeshift shelving. So yeah, so yeah. Ugh, not going to be fun. Well, it's melamine underneath, so at least there's that. Um, yeah, anyway. So it's still a mess in here. I just basically cleared a path and cleared the shelving so I can get to that. Um, and I've got peel and stick wallpaper going up. A really, really cool pattern. A really, really cool. Um, so that'll be going up too. So, let me show you the rest of the house so you can get an idea of what's going on. I've even got stuff lying here in the hallway. This is so cool. I haven't been able to get rid of it. I just love it so much. It's a shadow box. And I think it's going to go in the project room. I think that is going to go on top of... Where's baby Grayson? On top of this um, trunk. Here, here, baby Grayson wants to say hello. Say hello, say hello. <laughs> She's such a baby. She's such a baby. Okay, 
Uh, so in here, see I've just tried to keep everything a little organized. So I've got lots of glass here. Not really sure where it's gonna go. I think I'm gonna have to split it up. Um, and there's some decorative pieces in there. You all know my pension for spiders. And there's a honeycomb, a real one, that I took down from a house that I was staying at up here in Canada. And there's another one that I just put a couple of real quail eggs. So cool. Anyway, and then we've got books. And speaking of spiders, there's some more. And they will go in the project room as they're not really going to go with the... Oh, look at that one. This one's a faux spider, of course. Well, not of course, but it is. It's a faux spider. Um, handmade by an artist. I, I think it was the Ukraine. Took forever to get here. I love it. Love, love, love it. It's faux, faux fur. Not real fur. Love, love, love. Okay. Then there's... I'm sure there's going to be stuff in here I'm going to get rid of. There's my faux cow hides. Love, love, love. Ooh. That's my newest skeleton. Got it this... Uh, this winter season. The ram. Whoop, whoop, whoop. And files and projects. And I saved paper that came with packages so I can use that when I'm painting kind of thing. There's some frames. And I have uh, three fish tanks, actually. I'm not sure I'm going to keep any of them. They just really... I love them, but I'm not sure they really go. And here's my Santos that I made. Love, love, love. But... Again, not sure. Not sure she really goes. There's some more faux greenery I got. Love, love, love. And look at this, you guys. I love this. My little galvanized truck. Love, love, love. That will find a place somewhere. I have a thing for pencils. Things for weird things, I think. Anyway, there's some of my pencils. And there's stuff in the baskets. Yeah, stuff all over. And there's my really cool big jar that I got at the thrift store with my fruit. Pumpkin seeds, white seeds, love, love, love. I'll keep these for Halloween. Be a nice uh, decoration for Halloween. And then look at this, you guys. Love, love, love. This is an old shopping cart. I think it really goes with the theme, but I just don't know where yet it's going to go. It might even go outside. Don't know. Mini sewing machine. Looking forward to trying that out. And I got my sewing, regular sewing machine back, so I can use that because I want to do the Roman shade that I'm going to make for the window. Just need to get to that. And here's a couple of rugs that are going in the project room. Going to be drop dead cute. Cute, 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 cute. And here's a couple of baskets of ribbon and twine. They obviously go in the project room. And the stuff here on my island is all stuff that will find a home um probably down in the evil dead closet just because um it's christmas stuff sort of stuff and then over here try to keep this pretty bare because i sit here and eat and watch trump news um here's the start of some of the containers that i'm going to be using for inside the craft closet when i get to that so yeah so it's got a pretty good start. Look at these. I found these at the dollar store. Look how pretty they are. They're let's, there, pretty wood with black inserts. Love, love, love. So I've got four of them. So they stack nicely so I can put little labels on them. You know, those fabulous little labels I love. All right, so that's about it. Um, not sure how much I'm going to get done today. Not feeling that hot, to be quite honest. So I, I kind of feel like just going back to bed. Anyway, we'll see what happens. So anyway, that's update number one. Bye! Just a quick little look at how it's looking. Um, still have just a couple. Well, that was about uh, that was about two hours worth of work right there. So I still have less than two hours of work. I want to do the top, obviously, and then do a second coat in a few places on the bottom. That'll be, you know, a couple hours, and that'll be done. 
And yeah, still not decided if I'm going to paint the sides here black or leave them white. Not sure. I'm thinking black. Anyway, we'll see what happens. Here we are. It's all done. The closet is painted. I think it looks phenomenal. Stuff is going to look so cool against that black. So, so cool. And I think I did a pretty good job with my lines. Eh, pretty good. Eh, pretty good. Yeah, it'll do. Okay, so now on to the decorating of that and then I'm going to do the wallpaper, which will be phenomenally cool. All right. Okay, so here it is. Uh, this is my project room. It is not completely done, but it is almost there. I just have some detail work to do. So here it is. Look at my fabulous wallpaper. That's just peel and stick wallpaper. Is that not the coolest thing you have ever seen? And see how this room is way different than the house, but it still has that flow because of the colors. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Love, love, love. And in this room, I have my spiders and my bones, you know, that kind of stuff, because it doesn't really go with the rest of the house out there. There's some uh, spiders over there. Yeah, and there's a shelf I built. My desk, which is just uh, two filing cabinets that I found at Salvation Army. And then uh, a door on top. I got the door for free off of Craigslist, I think it was. Or Craigslist, which is our... No, uh, Castanet. Castanet. That's our Craigslist kind of thing up here. So, painted them all black, of course. Got my TV. I've got a nice big TV in here. And then I've got my, you know, my printer and whatnot. And I still have paint in here. That'll go away once I'm done with my projects. And there's my... I love bulletin boards with a bunch of this fun stuff on them. And I still have to hook up the picture light. I have another picture light over here. This one's chicken wire, the other one's cork, Bolton board. And in this trunk here, there's all my holiday decorations except for Christmas. Christmas is downstairs in the Evil Dead closet. And then I've got my tools over here. I've got the tools that I use most of the time, or I'm using most of the time right now anyway, on this little caddy that I got from Ikea that moves about and everything else is in this file cabinet. This file cabinet I got for five dollars and I just painted it black. And then in this trunk up here, I got this trunk I think at, yes I did, at Target when Target was still up here before it closed. I miss Target, I love Target. Anyway, um, I've got my computer stuff in there, you, you know, like um, different, I don't know, programs and I don't know, just stuff, for the computer stuff. Um, and then this over here, this is a little rack I picked up at, at the uh, thrift store. Um, and it's going to have all my kind of paper kind of uh, project stuff. It still has to be organized. And then I can put little labels here on all the little shelves. So, yeah, so that'll be cool. And then this over here, this is what used to be a closet that the owner uh, put shelves in. He used this area as his office, I believe. So he needed shelves more than another closet. So I just painted the inside black. And the shelves I left as they were, except for, you know, I painted this black. And I'll probably end up putting uh, labels on here. Oh, maybe, I don't know. Might be too much. But, uh, has some of my... Like in here, old day planners. I don't know why I keep them, but I do. Um, yeah, and there's ribbons and ribbons. So those are my burlap kind of ribbons. So those are my regular ribbon ribbons. And then I have my bugs and stuff here, which I love, love, love. But they don't really go out in the rest of the house. Just don't. They don't really work. 
And then in this chest here, this trunk here, I have projects and on top too, projects that are waiting to be done. So yeah, it could be worse. It could be a lot more. So I whittled that down to the projects I really want to get done. And there's my skeleton. Oh, I put all the skeletons that I have in here too. I'm going to use them mostly for uh, Halloween now. Um, and then my wall fountain I put up here. I put it way up high. And see how I like that. Because when I had it in the living room, you could see into the basin. And I didn't like that, especially when the light was on. I, you could see it. I, I didn't like seeing all the mechanics of it. And yes, it was, just wasn't pretty. So I'm trying it up high. See how I like that. And I still have to cover the cord with that white plastic strip. Oh, and then this thing I got from Amazon. I'll put some ribbons and whatnot on it. I don't know. I thought that was cool. And in the baskets, I still haven't labeled them yet. But like in here, I've got my Mat Lise bed linens. Um, in here is just paper, uh, rolled up paper stuff. So it'd be some paintings I did, wrapping paper, um, craft paper rolls, you know, that kind of thing in there. And here is... Um, that was a fabric remnants, um, just stuff that I'm using for, for projects. And look at, oh, look at this chair. I love this chair. I got this chair at uh, Ikea, believe it or not. Is that not the coolest chair? Love. <laughs> I don't love that. And it was inexpensive, of course, because it was, you know, Ikea. Um, there it's my wall cherub. Don't know yet where, where he's going to go. And the bin underneath, that is paperwork that I will be putting away soon, hopefully. That's from my uh, ex-landlady. Yeah, I won't even talk about that. So anyway, hopefully I can put that away and forget about it soon. So yeah, that's it. It's, once I get it all finished, I'm going to do a, a full house tour. You know, I'm going to do a before and an after video. and show you guys how far this house has come. And it's February now, and I moved here, uh, officially moved in in October. So, hasn't been that long, really. And it's really come along. I love this wallpaper. Love, 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 love. With my skeletons. Love, 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 love. Yeah. I think it really turned out well having the, the, uh, the shelves painted black, the background. See how everything just looks a little more sophisticated? It just it looks a bit more special, I guess. Not really sufficient, but special, you know, off the black. Yeah. If it, if something's painted white, it automatically feels cottagey to me. And that's that's not what I'm going for. So anyway. I love my trunks. Love, love, love. So anyway, that's it. That is it. Hope you like the tour. It's just some of my fun stuff up here. Some tags. I still keep tags from my sister, and there's some Halloween photos, and just stuff I printed off the computer. Oh, there's a fun ribbon I <laughs> I found on the internet. Oh, I just love my fun stuff. Well, here, I'll show you some of this fun stuff. Well, here's the spider my sister gave me. Love, love, love. So cool. I just love all this fun little stuff. Yeah, I have a thing for fun little stuff. I can't help it. I'm trying to curtail that. I seriously am. Look, more bones. <laughs> There's my chartreuse color. Love, 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 love. And kind of this lab wear kind of vase. I just think it's kind of fun. Thrift store. Anyway. Oh, look, here's that. You guys saw this in an earlier haul. I got this at a thrift store, painted it, and then I just... Well, they didn't really fit, but I, <laughs> I hammered them in. These two little um, galvanized cups that I got at the thrift store. So, yeah, they'll never come out, but that's okay. And look at the lamp my sister got for me. It's not plugged in yet. I still got to figure that out. There's only two plugs in this room. It's just insane. So I seriously have to figure that out. I think there's two. I hope there's... Well, maybe there's just one. I don't know. Anyway, I'll figure it out. I think it's two. Anyway, okay. So, hope you enjoy. There's my girl. Love, love, love her. She doesn't really fit in the rest of the house, though, but can't really get rid of her. Do something with her. Okay. Anyway, 
Talk to y'all later.